Welcome to Stupid Physics Tricks. Here I'll have my colleagues, former students, current students, friends, Romans, countrymen, people off the street, pretty much anybody I can get in here, do a trick for you. And the only rules are it has to be stupid and they have to explain the physics when they're done. Now, I must stress, this is not on the examination. This is only a demonstration. So please, no studying. Our first stupid physics trick is by Professor Doug Nadelson, my colleague here at Rice. All right, and what are you going to do? Well, I am going to take this softball-sized ball of silly putty, and I am going to shatter it with a sledgehammer. Uh, let me see this. So this is standard silly putty, kind of dirty, but it's very soft and flexible, and I cannot imagine how this could possibly be shattered, right? Because I just push, and I get a big indentation. And I've played with silly putty. I know I can stretch it. So good luck with that. I'm not sure how this is going to go down. It'll be fine. All right. Okay, so I'm going to put that there, yeah. and I'm going to pull out my sledgehammer oh. that I happen to have. Well, let me get a little further away. Yeah, you might want to back up a little <laughs> yeah. bit. Okay, so let me position myself. All right, here we go. Wow, that is amazing. How does that work? Well, let me pick up a piece here. You can see the, uh, the edges are even kind of shiny, like a piece of glass or something. So there are some materials where how they deform and respond depends on how fast you try and deform them. So you're probably more familiar with materials that get runnier when you try and deform them quickly. So toothpaste is a good example of that, or butter, um, or mayonnaise. Uh, but there are other materials like silly putty and I guess cornstarch and water mm -hmm. that actually get stiffer when you try and deform them quickly. Mm -hmm. And so what happened was we tried to deform this really fast with mm -hmm. the sledgehammer and it could not deal, so it just shattered into pieces. Very nice, very nice. Uh, this is my favorite, my favorite stupid physics trick so far. <laughs> Thank you. You, right, know, well, I, you know, I, I actually, I, I should say, I actually have a blog about physics. Oh, I, I, yeah, your blog. I blog yeah. at nanoscale.blogspot.com. Yeah. Uh, I, thought I should, thought I should mention that. And I actually, um, in fact, I actually have a book. Um, I happen to bring a copy. Uh, I have a textbook on, on nanoscale science. Doug, it's available from Amazon. This wanna... is a serious physics class. This is not some cheap, stupid talk show. So please that's, just. That's not what I heard. Just somebody get this guy out of yeah. here. We're all done right, with this all one. Right, this all one's right. done. Fine, fine. <laughs>